Good morning. I was asked to put up one more example of a continuous compounding problem. So if you're having trouble using the letter E and natural logs, this problem is for you. So here's the example I made. Sam received a $15,000 bonus at work. He decides to invest this money in an IRA, which is an individual retirement account, that is giving 15% interest if you do not touch the money for 25 years. The account compounds continuously. How much money does he have in the account in 25 years? How long will it take to triple his investment? Well, when you do a problem like this, the first thing you do, as I said in class, is always write out what you have. First, you have your initial amount, which is also the principal, which is the $15,000. The rate is 15%, which is 0.15. The time is 25 years for the first part. So now if I want to know how much he has in the account, the amount, or we can say the amount over time, we could write it either way, is equal to the principal times E to the RT power, so we call that PERT. So this one's a straight multiplication. Put in the 15,000 for the principal, put in Euler's number, the rate 15%, and the time is 25 years. So, you take your calculator, and this is what we are now typing in. We have our 15,000. We are hitting second and the natural log key for E. We're putting in the 0.15, and we're timesing it by 25. Coming out of the exponent, hitting enter, and wow, we made a lot of money. The amount that we made is $637,816.23. Okay, so this is a fantasy. Everybody wants to invest in earn money like this. <laughs> anyway, so now the second part of the question, how long would it take for his money to triple? Well, triple would be the 15,000 times three, which is 45,000. All right, so if he wants to know about his money tripling to 45,000, this is now the amount that we're looking for. So 45,000 is now equal to the 15,000 E to the 15%, but now we have the variable of time. So when we solve an equation, we always solve from the least important operation to the most important. And the least important here would be multiplication. So we're going to divide both sides by the 15,000. And this makes 3. Now I have 3 is equal to e to the 0.15 time. So I need to get this exponent out, and it's on e. I can only use a natural log. So if I put a natural log of 3 on the left, and then I put a natural log on E on the right, that's the power rule bringing down the point 0.15T. Now these guys cancel, their inverses, inverses cancel. So I am going to divide both sides by 0.15, and that's going to give me my time. So. I would take my calculator, natural log of 3, I divide it by 0.15, and I find out in 7.32408 years, so I will say the time is about 7.3 years, or I will say in the seventh year, his money tripled. I hope this helps those of you who are having trouble with the natural log and the E problems.